Williams. We spent the night right there. It is like snowing and like just a whiteout right now. Pretty crazy. I am awake and I am trying to find a bathroom and then I'm probably gonna go run my one mile. I just did my daily mile to the surf spot and there's actually a little wave coming in. It's probably too, probably like not there yet. I'm literally running on like ice and then I'm like doing surf check during it. So well just hasn't filled in yet. We're on it super early. Like we zoomed here. We wanted to drive during the day um, because the roads are super icy at night. So we figured come and yeah, we're here early. And I love being here early because we're prepared. As soon as it turns on, I'm gonna get in my wetsuit this time and we're gonna be out there. No. We set up shop. It's still undecided if it's gonna be good. The forecast is saying no, but our hearts are saying yes. <laughs> so we're gonna head over there, probably cook some breakfast, hang out, and hopefully score. You were looking at this, right? Actually a pretty big line going down right now um emlyn and alex are doing some cooking getting some eggs going back there but there could be a wave this is a big set this like might break let's go <laughs> let's go it's gonna do it dude it's fully gonna do it we just need like a little longer that's a good set just doing some editing right now while we are waiting for the swell to fill in, Emlyn and Alex are back here kicking some eggs. Wow, that was pretty impromptu. <laughs> but um, yeah, I'm actually kind of getting cold because I'm drinking cold water and I was, I'm was i in my like running outfit. So I'm gonna stop editing in a little bit and um, yeah, getting some warmer clothes. Even though the tide was supposed to be getting better, the swell is like not here. I think the swell's like kind of died or something. Like, I just don't know what's getting on. Honestly, I'm pretty tired. It'd be a lot of work to get the snowboard set up and hike up one of these mountains behind us. But we met um, some other travelers and that's actually what they're doing. They're going like backcountry skiing right now. It is really cold out here. This is all we're seeing is just, it's like one foot lines. It's not really breaking yet posted up on the spot right now. It's definitely been like kind of a waiting game today. We're just kind of hanging out. Not really sure. We've been talking about going to some other spots, but I don't know. I think I've been thinking about breaking the snowboard out, but a little more intimidating now because there's like no visibility and it's just gnarly. white out right now it's coming down i'm on the roof here trying to get the boards alex is filming through the quiver it is bucketing like we just took that snowboard down and it's already covered in snow this is brutal this is some of the most snow i've been in the waves haven't turned on yet and even if they don't i'm gonna snowboard that hill so who cares we're stoked right now this is like the best day of my life we we're just watching some surf movies getting pumped up and uh, I'm just happy to be here and happy to be alive. Huh. Let's go! Look at this snow! Dude, I'm, even if there's no waves, like, I'm just so fired up on the snow. Like, this is just the coolest day ever. Let's go. <laughs> We've been waiting around all day, hiding out in the van, and we finally see some sets coming in. I think I'm gonna paddle out, and it's just gonna get, like, even better as we go. There's, like, snow coming down so fast. But yeah, there's little lines. We're out there. Let's do it.
<laughs> Got him. All right, guys. That was a humbling, humbling session. I was just like, we were running around trying to get all this like B-roll for the movie and stuff. And the waves were like so good. And we were running around getting B-roll. The snow was dumping. It was coming down like kind of fastest I've ever seen it. My face is like so messed up right now. Got out there. I got a few ones while they were setting up. I got out there. Then I ran back, grabbed the GoPro after a few waves, went back out. As soon as I got back out there, things started to get kind of weird. The north wind started blowing and I was like, oh no. And then it just got so choppy, so wonky, so weird. It would be so big right now if the wind was offshore, but we're in here for the long haul. It's supposed to storm for like three days now. So I'm just gonna try to weather the storm and maybe go snowboarding. like the surf in a fjord. We're stoked. We're waiting for a set. Slippery. All right, guys, we got absolutely just hit with like full windstorm, rain, pretty tough. I like ran up to go get the, like tight, tighten the, the boards we had on the roof down. And then Alex and I grabbed his board bag, my 6'8", put them in, in here because there's no way we're getting on them on the roof. Uh, we're, we gotta, we're moving to a wind protected area down the block so we can, fully you know yeah pull ourselves together pull a little bit together. yeah <laughs> little update we haven't gone anywhere um i'm super tired we are just kind of hanging out here surfing is definitely not gonna happen the rest of the day it's just super hard onshore winds we're kind of getting hitting getting hit by like a classic winter storm right now it's raining it's snowing and yeah we're just gonna cozy up we got the heat blasting in the van and I'm doing some editing right now. And um, yeah, we'll give you an update before we go. Yeah, I actually feel like we're eating pretty good. Like a lot of protein, healthy food. We're not just like snacking down cookies and stuff. All right, thank you.